<laughs> All right, how are we doing tonight? Woo! You guys having a good time so far? You have a good time getting to your seat and everything cool? Good, good. I'm glad you enjoyed that experience. We hope you like the music a little better. So we are on behalf of the Jerry Garcia Foundation and Jerry Garcia Music Arts. We are here today to have this pre-Jerry Garcia birthday party. Yay! So, um, during the night you'll learn how influential he was to my life, and to my dad's life, and to uh, why we're here tonight. So, um, I want to also say hello to KGGV Radio, which is here, and RussianRiverRadio.com RiverTheaterRadio.com It's RussianRiverRadio.com RiverTheaterRadio.com See, I've been doing it for too long. I was a young skinny kid when I met him. But see what his influence has done? Blew me up to 250 pounds. <laughs> anyway, my name is Tony Saunders. I am the son of Merle Saunders, and when I was 17 years old, I got the pleasure to play with my dad and Jerry, and it changed my whole life. And we'd like to say happy birthday to Rainey. Can we all give her a round of applause? Make her blush, make her blush. All right, so, there's also, there's Dave too. Let's give her a round of applause. She came from Paris, and she was at those Keystone live recordings way back when she wasn't even supposed to be in the club. So the music we play was from live at Keystone, which was done in 1972. I wasn't there because I was only in the 12th grade, and I played on the football team, and the coach told me I couldn't go to the gig because he knew the other stuff that happened after the gig and stuff. You know, we had practice the next day. But anyway, my dad and Jerry recorded these uh, live at Keystone recordings, and it's pretty awesome, because I can tell you that the music has lived for 51 years. Isn't that something? That's awesome. Um, I, had, I had, I remember one of the conversations that I had with Jerry was, would this music last? And he goes, of course, Sonny. And I mean, he had that foresight even then. Um, you know, and all the music that he was playing. He liked to play with everybody, which is one of the reasons he played with my dad. He liked to play with everybody. He liked to play with Gritzman. He liked to play with the Dan. He liked to play with a lot of different groups. And, and out of that, we got a lot of great music. And who would have fathomed that, that when they started this music in 65, that they'd, there'd be a group called Dan Company playing, playing Grateful Dead music. You know what I'm saying? You know, so much later, you know what I'm saying? So it's, so it's a big thing. And Jerry would be so flabbergasted that we all played his music because he was a mild-mannered guy, really didn't, you know, wasn't tripping on none of the stardom kind of guy stuff, you know? He wasn't, he, he never pictured himself as a star. He was just a guitar player, you know what I mean? And, and he just wanted to play great music and learn great music. So I was able to see that at a young age, and so that's why I'm here tonight. So that's 17 when I started playing. So I've had 50 years of playing these songs. So I got them down now. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Larry Van back here on drums. He was also there with me a lot of those times back in the day with Jerry. We actually saw Jerry take his amp out of his car and carry his amp and his guitar and come play the gig. He actually knew how to do that. He didn't need Steve Parrish all the time. Okay? And he would just show up when my dad didn't know he was coming, you know? So we would play all these little gigs, and all of a sudden, I go like, wow, that's Jerry, he's here tonight too. You know, and so that's, that's a lot of love, you know what I'm saying? So that's why I'm here tonight, to continue that music. And we still have his guitar here, Alligator. Johnny Mojo, that's going to be playing it tonight. He's going to be making that guitar sing, just like Jerry did. Thank you, Grateful Guitarist Foundation. 
Yes, good. Yeah, Andy Logan, we thank you very much for always coming through. Um, he's he's a, just a wonderful guy, wonderful family. His son, let's give his son a round of applause, yeah. Hayden. Because Hayden just had a miracle happen today. And I'm, without going into detail, let's just give him a big round of applause. <laughs> this young lady on uh, vocals right here in front of me, Stephanie Hartwell Mandela, hey. just played with JGB a few weeks ago at the Warfield. And uh, so Melvin blessed her, and we won't go into that in any further, but we all love Melvin. Um, but, uh, and on other, the other vocalist is Sunshine Garcia Becker, who was sang in further, and in JGB, and various other concoctions of Dead Set with Zach Newton and Scott, and uh, you know, several concoctions of this. And then over there, we have my buddy, Scott Gooman on keyboard. Ooh, ooh, goo, goo, goo. Let's give him a goo. Ooh, ooh. So Scott is, Scott is, I just thank God that Scott came along and, and he liked to play this music because we're like friends and he likes to play the music. You know what I mean? So what more can you do when your best friend likes to play the music? You know what I'm saying? So we're gonna play some music for you back in the day, and we hope we keep you entertained. If we don't, buy another cocktail, because we'll sound better. <laughs> all right? All right. All right, no more talking for Tony. The eyes get on me, because I talk too much. Anyway, my name is Tony Saunders, and uh, welcome you tonight to this wonderful event. Happy birthday, Jer. Thank you, Jerry. <laughs> Thank you. 